How's it going, Nick from Virgineers? And up for review, we've got a double IPA from Phantom. Um, and this is double patty. Double IPA, like I say, coming in at 8%. And it is brewed with... Well, I've got the grain bill. So it's um, oats, wheat and chits, so barley. So, And on the hops, it's got a Zaka, brew one and citra. Ooh, okay, interesting. So this might have a bit of a westy bite to it, but obviously with the oats and that sort of thing. So I do like this sort of style, you know, sort of hybrid. Phantom are in craft beer nerds world an up and comer. I've had some. It's been good. I mean, it's not worked its way into my top. They've not worked their way into my top five. But, you know, I haven't had any uh, stinkers from Phantom. Where are Phantom? Red ink, okay. So let's see what we've got. I got this from Fuss Club. It's probably about 650, something like that. The best before day is December, yeah? So there's no canning date. It just says best before um, middle of December. Okay, it's fairly lively. Couple of things of bubbly white head. I think we're definitely into porridge territory there. Yeah, look at that. As thick as you like it. Nose, if we're going to get anything through that. It smells quite funky. Cheesy, feety, danky. Maybe a hint, a hint of fruit there, I'm, I'm not sure. It's probably not a lot, that head's pretty thick. Um, looks the bollocks, but what's it gonna taste like? Let's see, chin chin. So it's a, it's a good double. There is a sweetness to it. They, first comes the sweetness, then comes the, the, the earthy dank, and then there's a pleasant bit of bitterness at the end. There's not massive amounts of fruit. It's very, very well balanced. Oh, yeah. I do like, yeah. So what I do like about it is that it's sweet at first. Dank, pleasant bitterness, mouthfeel. Exceptional mouthfeel. Oh, yeah. That's like a beak like mouthfeel. Soft, pillowy. I think the uh, the adjective goes um, really well done. Um, there's nothing jump, there's nothing massively to differentiate this from all the other New England style double IPAs that are on the channel. But it's really good, really, really good. Worth the money, 100%. Rating. So I've previously been reviewing a, a couple of spoons, beers, but I'm back now to reviewing, you know, it's, it's got to stand up against the pantheon of uh, excellence here. Um, and what would I rate this? Eight out of 10, which is bloody good. 8 out of 10 for Double Patty. Like I said, I got it from Fuss Club. Not sure whether it's still available. It's really nice, really good. New England style. Double IPA. Get it if you can. Decent. Until next time, cheers.